Well, 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 if it isn't what appears to be a pile of scrap. Hello everyone, it's Dusk and Mods, here with what appears to be a Pip-Boy computer that runs Windows 10. Now I have made a lot of these things, and I mean a lot of these things. I have had a lot of prototypes built up to get to the versions that I'm at, and it's not even done now. I have gotten the current one to run Windows, but unfortunately the case is not quite big enough, which would explain why in Fallout these things are fucking huge. They kind of have to be. Uh, the one that I've got now, I've gotten most of the pieces put together. Uh, the adjustments that I've got in the new one is just going to be a raised forehead and integrating the two pieces that you see where the wires go they're just integrated into the same design luckily my 3d printer was actually able to recognize this and print it because most of the time it just won't recognize uh, complicated stuff and just ignore it I don't know why it does this but it's Cura software so <laughs> Uh, I've gotten the screen in it, which was probably a bad idea because I hot glued it in place. So I'm probably going to need to get another one if I happen to break this one upon removal. Uh, other than that, everything is working and on schedule, at least on my schedule. I've gotten a couple of years planned to do this. But nevertheless, I've got actually one piece printing right now. And I'll let you guys know on the next update of how this is going to go. Hopefully, everything does fit in the new case housing where it's been redesigned appropriately. Although, this wouldn't be the first time I've had to redesign it. Well, like I said, we'll see where it goes from there. If you guys enjoy this content, please remember to like and subscribe for more. Peace out.